Hey everybody, it's that time again. I'm talking about time to color my hair. Now you all know that I have loved Revlon's Total Color home hair color so much, but I've decided that it's time I need to turn up the intensity because this. There are so many more grays after having my sweet baby girl. And I, I always feel like sometimes I look in the mirror and I see gray highlights. <laughs> and that's not the look I'm going for. So I'm gonna try out Revlon's best-selling color soap hair color. So um, this is actually the best-selling hair color on the market. Um, I'm really excited to try it. So I'm using the dark brown color and I'm gonna get started. Um, first things first, I always put down a dark towel on my counter and I always wear a black t-shirt or an old t-shirt when I'm gonna color my hair at home. So I'm gonna divide it into sections first. So these front two and then a back two. What I'm gonna do is take these, gotta get all of it, take these and twist them up. I want to make sure I get every little spot of this. This is a good look, right? <laughs> then I'm just going to take these bottom two and put in a little ponytail. This, this is really, this is, this is special, this look. Okie dokie. My hair is so long right now too. I'm in need of a haircut. Okay. All right. This is how we're starting. Next thing I'm going to do is prepare my hairline. So I like to take a little petroleum jelly and I just kind of go around where I have these baby hairs. This way you don't get any color on your skin. There you go. Take a little down here around the nape of your neck as well. If you get color there. Okay, now let's mix our color. Cut off the tip of the bottle here. I'm gonna open up this is the color here. And this is ammonia free, very important to me. I'm gonna put my gloves on. It comes with these gloves. Important to cover your hands so you don't get color on your hands. Okay, I'm so excited for this. I'm ready for my hair to look good. I always find that when your hair looks good, you just feel like a new person. Like blowing out your hair nice, adding some curls. It all starts with the color though. Okay, so now I'm gonna take this, pour it right in to activate. The white bottle is the color developer. Get it all in there. There we go. And then put the lid back on. And now put your finger over the tip and shake it up. And you want to really, really get this nice and shaken up. You can see it's starting to come together. See the color developing. So my best friend, Greta Monaghan, is a master colorist. So I got lots of great tips from her on how to color my hair at home. And I've been doing it now for, I guess it's been about a year and a half of home hair color. And I'm really happy with it. I like that it's on my terms, my schedule. Now I'm gonna start with this section and you wanna start where your grays are the worst because that way they'll have more time to get the color. So I'm just gonna start right here. And I kinda use my fingers to pull it and then I use the bottle tip to go up in small sections. There's some grays hiding in there. I'm looking mostly to color my roots today. Okay, first section's done. I get a lot of questions about home hair color and I really think it's a lot like cooking. You just need to be prepared so you get everything in its place before you get started and then it's a lot easier. There's not this frantic feeling of 
getting everything in the recipe chopped up while you're trying to saute something else. This is like, get all of your hair color out, lay it all out, have your clips ready to go to do pull up the hair, have your timer ready to set, then you're okay. All right, now this section's done, and I'm actually, I'm just gonna take both of these to get them out of my way. All of this and put it into another clip. Now I'll do this section. So this makes it a lot easier to get the back of your head as well, to do it in these sections. So you can just kind of pull it around. And if you need help with the back of your head, you can ask somebody you live with or somebody that you feel safe with. My mom and I used to always do home hair color when I was a little girl, actually with this Revlon color silk. This is what my mom always used. And I would color her hair for her. I would do the back of it. So this product is also infused with keratin. It's gonna give you a nice, healthy, strong look. That's what I'm going for. What nice, healthy looking hair. I've been losing a lot of hair postpartum. I feel like I gained a lot of hair when I was pregnant and now I'm losing a lot of it. So give me a really nice gloss, a nice finish and pull all the color together. Just gonna take it and have at it. Like I said, I got a lot of hair here. And go underneath now with this color. And just pull it through. And this is gonna give it a really nice natural finish. You can use a comb as well. I just like using my fingers. I think I get a really good natural look that way. All right, I'll pull down another section. You know, the ends of your hair are always a little bit lighter than the roots, so this is a good way to get that natural look. If you have really stubborn grays, you're gonna leave it on for five minutes longer. I leave this on for 20 minutes. And I'm just gonna do a quick check. Make sure I got the gray parts covered. This is my, this is my danger zone. All right, looks good. I'm gonna set my timer for 20 minutes, wash my hair, and then meet me back here. All right, time to wash my hair, and I'm gonna use the conditioning packet as well. I can already tell the color looks really good. I can't wait to dry it and see the finished product. All right, here we go, the finished product. I am so happy with this color. It is so nice and rich and shiny. I love it. Less than five bucks for a box of this, and I got to do it all at home on my terms, my schedule. Iris, what do you think? You like it? She likes it. That's all that matters.